Hi guys, so this is going to be a Costco haul. I literally just got back and I threw everything on top of my counter. Um, I did get a case of waters, but they're still in my um, in my trunk because I just wanted to get these things up here and eat something before my oldest one got home. And then he got home like literally 10 minutes after, which if you hear some crunching, he's having a snack right next to me. So starting right over here. So the main reason that I went to Costco was for flour tortillas because they are cheaper at Costco and then I came out with I think it was like 88 and change so starting right over here I got some corn tortillas I got some tortilla chips they're just the Kirkland tortilla chips because my mom came last weekend and she brought us homemade um, salsa and we ran out of tortilla chips so we needed more tortilla chips I grabbed a rotisserie chicken, which it's like a must when you go to Costco. Plus, these things are massive compared to like the ones you buy at like at your local grocery store or Walmart, and they're the same price, $4.99. I grabbed a five dozen um, case of eggs, $8.99. I grabbed some bananas. I think that was a dollar forty-nine. I cannot remember the price of the pesto, but I grabbed some pesto because I have a lot of shrimp in the fridge and I would like to make some sort of pasta with pesto. I had my little one with me because we went after school because I just didn't have time to go in the morning and he wanted raspberries and he wanted blackberries which right now we're like fully stocked. Raspberries, blackberries, bananas. We already have some strawberries and grapes in the fridge and I told him this time if you do not eat everything we're gonna stop buying all this fruit all at once because when we have all of this fruit he wants like none of it once we get home and then when I don't buy it he wants all of the fruit does anybody else have that problem with their kids at least I do I got some of my what I call lazy but delicious salads this is just a Taylor Farms Asian cashew chop salad which I call them instant salads you throw everything in a bowl throw the mixing and the little crispy things and instant salad and it is delicious and then I also I've been seeing this in a lot of um, grocery hauls it is the organic sweet kale vegetable salad again you throw everything and then it comes with a little um, like dressing and instant delicious salad and then I have purchased these in the past I haven't bought them in a while just because I kind of got tired of them they're the grilled Mediterranean style chicken skewers these are already pre-cooked, grilled. You literally just warm them up and they are delicious. Really, really good. They are kind of pricey for what they are. They're a pound and a half, so 24 ounces. Yeah, 1.5 uh, um, pounds. Um, I want to say they're like 12 bucks, which I think are kind of pricey, but they're really, really good. And if you're like me, I'm not the best cook in the world. This is like right up my alley. And then the samples got us today. They were sampling these Palio Sabatina organic basil and cracked black pepper smoked chicken sausages, 12 links, pre-cooked, pork free, keto friendly, yada, yada, yada. You guys know I'm not about that lifestyle. I eat, I like to eat, I like food. I'm not in not any sort of diet, but honestly, you cannot tell these were healthy. These were really, really good. Um, these were also kind of pricey. I want to say these were like 13 and change, which about a dollar or so a link, which I guess it's not so bad, but they were really good for being as healthy as they are. And like I said, the main thing I went for was flour tortillas because I can get a 40 pack of tortillas for $3.99 versus like $6 even at grocery outlet. So I'd rather make the trip to Costco, which kind of balances it, itself out because once you get there, it's like you start tossing things and then you start sampling things. And before you know it, you might as well go on to grocery outlet. So that's that. So like I said, I spent about 88 and change. Um, today is April 5th. My membership is going to be due in June because I bought it last year as like part of my birthday present. Um, and I honestly don't know at this point if I'm going to renew my membership just because it's like you go to Costco to save money here and save money there, but then you start adding all these other things that, you know, you need or do you really need them and then it kind of adds up. 
And I have the same feeling every time I leave Costco, like, what did I buy? And the same feeling I had today, I'm like, $88, like, what did I spend? Um, and I'm just more of a fan of going to, like, grocery outlet, and then what I don't find there, I end up purchasing at Walmart. So, we shall see. I'm still kind of going back and forth, back and forth, so that's that. So, I hope you guys are having a great Friday, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.